Just get the fuck out! Now! Doing what he's saying. We need to break through this thing. Guys, I I, I can't. Go and look the cubby to knock this door down. Me and Mark will try and force it open. Who's there? <gasps> oh, spooky man. Me. Get, get away from me! Oh. Uh, I'm gonna take that inhaler. Oh, I made the wrong mistake. Oh. Unless... Yeah, I would've came. I mean, wait. Use a bitch. Okay. Easy, easy. In and out. You're okay now. You're safe. What? Did you see him? Come on. <laughs> he... he was... somebody was right there. In there with me. Aaron, it's just a dummy. No, it was not a dummy. He... he had a hat on, like H.H. H. Holmes. Charles, you're working her to death. Now she's hallucinating shit from the show? I did not. Nothing bad happened, Erin. You're okay. No one is in there. Let's all just calm down, get Erin back to her room for a rest. I'm not fucking tired. Let's go. Come on, Erin. Me as a kid. I'm not even tired. I'm not going to bed. Pass out five seconds later. Really? You're already back with this guy? Ah. There you are. Hello. I think Erin's shown signs of serious pluck, wouldn't you say? Now, where's our wayward host, Mr. Dumet? Apparently, he's left the island. How very rude not to stay for dinner. Charlie managed to rally the troops, though, and a good thing. The road ahead is full of challenges. I can only observe, and it can be frustrating to watch. In some ways, I envy you. I only record events. You get to shape them. 
You'd better get back to things before one of our friends makes a poor choice on their own. Oh. Okay, bye. Let's just all take a deep breath and not lose our minds. No, Charles. We're done. This has been weird every step of the way, and now it's getting scary. Oh, relax. I'm serious. Everything about this is off. Kills me to admit it, but Kate is right. Somebody tried to attack Aaron. We don't know that's what actually happened. I know what I saw. In the dark. You think I'm making this up? Everyone relax, okay? Just give me a second to think. Excuse you. <sighs> And exit stage left, our oh-so-confident and sure leader. What was that? <sighs> Charlie is thinking, which looks a lot like a temper tantrum. Maybe he's right. If we don't crush this episode, we're all screwed. Are you kidding me? What? I'm just I've saying... I've been waiting on you for ages to actually make a decision about something. Anything. And now... This is when you suddenly choose to take a stand? Sorry, maybe I'm crazy, but if Aaron says somebody came for her, I believe her. We're not safe here. It was just a dummy. You think I'm lying? Really? I think maybe you're just confused about what you saw in the dark. I know Damn. what I saw. Mansplaining what I saw. Right, here's the plan. We've already got a plan. It's leaving. Just listen. <sighs> We cannot <laughs> jump to conclusions. I'm going to go and find Dumet and get clear on everything. Everything is going to be fine, okay? And we're going to get the footage we need. He didn't show for dinner. What makes you think you can find him now? A positive attitude. You should try it sometime. Bravo, Charles. Your delusions make for such great plans. Dumet left. I saw it, remember? Maybe he's back now. Maybe he's not. Would it kill you to think positively just once? I guess as far as Charlie ideas go, it's not the worst he's ever had. It's not even the worst idea I've had this evening. Don't go patting yourself on the back. I still think your priorities are fucked. Whatever. I'm going. I'm coming with you. Wait. Do you have to go? I'll be right back. Promise. Just stay put so I know where to find you, okay? I don't care what he says. I'm done. I'm getting my shit together. Kate. I'm leaving, Mark. You coming or not? <sighs> Aaron saw someone. Okay, you're right. Sorry, it's just Charlie said. We're not safe here. That outweighs having a damn job. You're right. Let's go, Aaron, everything's gonna be okay. Wait here. Can't you just stay here while I pack up my stuff? I don't wanna waste any time. I'm right around the corner. Let's all be quick. We'll be right back. <laughs> if Promise. it stays around the corner. No, don't. Uh, sorry, just. Still freaked out. Can you leave it open so you guys can hear me? Of course. Why wouldn't you open the door more, though? Like... Okay, genius. Where are we going to look first for Dumet? I'm not looking for Dumet. I'm scouting for shots. If he pops up along the way, great. Jesus. You really don't care about anything else, do you? Of course I care. Tell that to Kate. You know as well as I do, if we're set up and a camera is rolling, she'll want to be in front of it. <sighs> Asshole. One eighty. What happened here? I. No idea. Don't worry, I got my lighter. We'll light it up. I wonder if that groundskeeper would know where the met went.
I thought that he had added those notes. Not um Charlie, but wait, what? The hell? Okay, can't examine that. I guess we could just look at it for what it is. Secrets. Oh, I guess that makes sense. What are you gonna take a shit? What are you doing over there? I don't remember, or I mean, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh. Jamie, over here. Okay, yeah. I'm freaking the fuck out. It's just blood. Just blood? Are you just an alarming amount of blood? Conclusions. All we know is something was dragged along this way and it was bleeding. And that's not a cause for concern to you? All right, it's a little odd. Odd? What do you want hmm. me to say? Look, it's probably just Dumet or the groundskeeper dragging in some dead animal from outside. Maybe it's our dinner. Welcome, one and all, to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the fuck? Presented by Grantham Dumet. Dumet? What? So he hasn't left. This man really has never heard of a recording. I guess I just can't go near that door. You go near any of these fucking doors. Is that the fucking CIA? Oh, FBI. I was close. First met Agent Monday on October 12th, 1997 at O'Hare Airport when I was assigned to welcome him off the plane. I'd actually met him once before at a lecture on criminal behavior given a few weeks prior here in Chicago, but I don't even remember me from that. I was pretty nervous as the new kid on the block. I was just out of training and I'd been assigned to...
Yikes, I didn't unmute my mic. What's happening? What did I do? I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. Now. Charlie. Huh? Let's go. How oh, is he not bleeding? I don't know if he cut, like, here on his nose. Damn. The mask? What the hell was that? Are you shitting me? It's like that fucking movie Smart House or whatever. Jesus. We're trapped. What do we do? Break the fucking door down. Right. On three. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> You hear that? Yes. What is happening? Fuck. Oh. Find your spirit crystal? Don't do that. And don't make fun of me. Sorry. Wouldn't want you to cut yourself. The rock is sharp as hell and, you know, super magical. It's an amethyst crystal. It helps keep you calm by blanketing you in protective energy. I know. I remember. If you know, then don't call it a rock. Maybe I just feel like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop outsourcing the Damn. job to a crystal. It makes me feel better. It makes me feel better. You fucking cuck. Something you never seem to be able to do. Oof, with your limp ass dick. Okay, maybe that was a shitty thing to say. Oh, don't keep calm events? It's fine. This isn't the time or place to. I have to tell you something. Okay. I also don't remember that being you. brought out that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? It wasn't a job, not really. What are you talking about? Let the man finish his sentence. Holy he shit. Setting up a studio in Brooklyn, Fine Arts. He wanted a partner. That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought you tell me it was insane, rightfully. Cause it would be. Why didn't you go for it? Why the hell didn't you go for it? Okay, that was kind Why of aggressive. Didn't you tell me. Things were already starting to get tough for us. <sighs> No, no, no. Don't put any of this on me. Oh my god. This is all you. Oh. I know. I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. I didn't think about that. I... I guess I didn't even think of that. I... I just... Uh, oh. What do you want me to say? Guess I was holding out for things to change with us. Deep down, I'm still hoping. You slept with my cousin? Oh, that's not an option. Uh... I... Mm. You should have said all this before. I know. Oh. Oh. I'm not going through it all again. What if this time is different? Oh, come on. That's not likely, and you know it. Sorry. I guess I'm a little confused. It's the wrong time. We better go. Let's get back to Aaron and get the fuck out of here. Go, bitch. Charles seems hell-bent on talking to him, so maybe, yeah. Who's going around locking these doors? Excuse me. It's a little helper in the yellow coat. Wait. What's that? Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? No. Is that her? Yeah. Shelby. Matching nails? God, don't. 
We always got them done the same. That's him. What? That's him. The guy in the back. You know him? He kind of did. He was just one of those guys that was always around. Moved okay. Some of the same parties, but that's it. He just beat places. I don't... It was my fault. You know, that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. You it was a big deal on bitch. campus not to go out on your own. Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and that's when they, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! <laughs> 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 I can't hold this. Listen, you have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out now! Uh, Jamie! Charlie! What the hell just happened? Uh, you saw what happened to the wall shut. But I think it's bitch. really. 